Queens residents are pleading for help. Homeowners who live near Casino Park are fed up as storms keep sending water rushing into their homes. City News' Elijah Westbrook has more from Flushing, where those homeowners voice their concerns at a town hall Thursday night. It's been a disaster for neighbors who live near Casino Park. I'm getting water from around the block. It's coming to my house. I've flooded five times since I Ongoing flooding issues from outdated infrastructure, according to the city, is forcing some homeowners to dish out tens of thousands of dollars to fix their properties after a big storm rolls through. Last year, Hurricane Ida showed the worst of the problem, but the recent heavy rain has caused even more trouble. We expect home to be a place of comfort where you can relax and not worry too much. In a town hall led by lawmakers and city leaders Thursday night, residents demanded answers to a solution for the problem. Too many families in this area have to worry every time it rains. I mean, what kind of life is it when you have to worry about it when it rains? Congresswoman Grace Meng says the city needs more federal infrastructure funding to make the fix. In the meantime, we need to be uh, more better compensated because it costs a lot more. And we got reimbursements that were almost uh, a slap in the face, $5,000 in some cases for repairs that were 30, 40, 50, upwards of tens of thousands of dollars, and we can't accept that. Now, we've also learned during this meeting last night that the city is in the process of identifying problem spots in the area to see where critical pieces of infrastructure are needed. That process is expected to take place over the next few days, and of course, we will keep you posted on their findings. Reporting here in Flushing, Queens, Elijah Westbrook, CBS 2 News. All right, well, more 